of these uh, sculptures on the main street here. Pretty good. Not quite sure what they're supposed to symbolize. Well, it looks like a schoolgirl and a schoolboy. Let's go over and have a wee look. These are the uh, these are the linen bleachers. Would you believe that's the, uh, the folded up piece of linen that they're holding between them, and this is uh, reminiscent of our industrial past. The linen bleachers at half past five. The horn will blow. Six o'clock. We must all. We must. We all must go. And if you be a minute late, Robert McCabe will shut the gate. Local poem. Unknown author. Very good. There's a wee bit of the local history here. Lurgan has been renowned worldwide for its linen cloth, with bleach greens in the townland of Docker, Kinnico and Drumna Kelly. In Journey to the no Ye North, 1708, Dr. Molyneux observed that Lurgan was almost entirely peopled with linen weavers. The average wage for a linen weaver was 10 shillings for a 56 hour working week in 1911. And in 1953, my mother in law got 30 bob a week. So, a memorial to our linen industrial past. Good shoe. 